Bharat, I always add on to what he says. I just want to tell Bharat, uh, the Indian Air Force undertakes overall the Mirage engines, the A-32 engines and the B-70 engines. You missed out that when you said that. And I'm totally in agreement with what Bharat said. It is time HAL goes into manufacturing and the MRO being given to the private players. We in the Indian Air Force are pushing for it at all forums so that HAL is actually overloaded. They don't have the capacity to do MRO. The aircrafts are delayed passing out. There are a lot of issues. So we are also pushing the Air Force uh, at a very high level that HAL, you please look after manufacturing. Let the MROs be given to the private industries, how it is done abroad. So that is one point I'd like to add on. Second, coming to technologies, I just want to add on certain points. In the Indian Air Force, we are going big way into digital twinning. Uh, we are trying to collect our FDR data and hand over to the industry so that they can start working on the life extension projects for the aero engines, how the engine life can be extended, how the airframe life can be extended. We are getting a lot of automation projects. So we are in touch with IIT Jodhpur, IIT Mumbai, IIT Chennai. We are getting into automatic AA based refueling project is already launched. We are getting into autonomous tow tugs where you know the tow tugs do the entire towing right from taking the aircraft from the hangar right into the point of where the aircraft is a startup. We have got into uh, a swamp a drone technology for airframe inspection which Air Marshal Sukchain has said. So we are in touch with IIT Mumbai, they are working on us. IIT Jodhpur is helping us out. Second is, uh, we are using drone technology for aero engine inspections. And then we are using the AI for using mule technology. That means, based on mule is for cutting of armament stores from uh, the weapon storage area to the aircraft. So there, there is a lot of uh, technology intensive work which is going on. And the entire maintenance management is digitized in the Indian Air Force. The supply chain management is digitized in the Indian Air Force. And we have a lot of AI projects too. We have got projects where we can predict the failure of a Su-30 engine. And in fact, we have been able to save two to the engines because of these AA based projects. We've got an entire calibration, uh, which is an AA base, which predicts whether the calibration is required or not required. So there, there's a big way going on. Now, coming to sharing of information, yes, uh, the forces are open as far as aviation is concerned to share the information. Yes, definitely there will be a non disclosure act, which you'll have to sign on it so that the data doesn't go out of you. But yes, we are, because today the Air Force. Uh, we know that digital twinning is going to be the future of, uh, uh, you know, for life extension studies. So we are ready to share data with you. And uh, it's, it's a big way we have started sharing with IIT Mumbai where we are doing uh, 3D printing, digital printing of components so that we can analyze between the two components. The project has already started. So we are already uh, in the process of giving a supply order to them. So sir, as far as data, uh, as far as aviation is concerned, not an issue, but yes. The caveat is that there will be a non disclosure act that the company doesn't share the data with anybody else. But we are open so that, you know, uh, predictable maintenance, AI, uh, data analysis, all can be carried out.